that uh, would that fall under a coping mechanism? Is that what that is? Is, um, or is that different? Well, I-, I mean, there's there are coping mechanisms and there are emotion regulation mechanisms. I try to eschew those titles because okay. you know people do whatever they do, you know, and um, the, so I mean, it is sort of a coping mechanism. It is an emotion regulation mechanism, and it's could be whatever else you want it to be. Like say, getting drunk one evening just because you want to is useful at times you know mm-hmm. and i don't know if that's is that what you call list. an ugly coping mechanism <laughs> yes exactly yeah <laughs> yes I, yes I, I used the term ugly coping back in the first book on the, the book about bereavement and i've continued to work with it the idea because situations are so different you know they're so varied and in some situations you just have to use something and in, in that particular moment that's you wouldn't even think it was healthy and other people don't think it was healthy, but it's going to work right at this moment. It's what you need because the goal is really just to get past the difficult part. Hmm. And, you know, if you if you did this, uh, what, I, what I called ugly coping, these things all the time, then you maybe be, you know, kind of have to question that. But at any given moment, it's uh, the goal is really as John Lennon. I love the way John Lennon put it, whatever gets you through the night. Hmm. All right, all right, you know, but yeah. um, <laughs> <laughs> I think legally that's as much of the lyrics as you're allowed to say. I think <laughs> further, we owe it. Yeah. Point taken. <laughs> <laughs>